Democrats have blasted the administration for temporarily separating illegal immigrant families at the border. Unimaginably, they have ripped children away from their parents. It is inhumane. It is cruel. When you take children away and separate families, you are doing the complete opposite of the values of this nation. Those children should be with their moms and their dads. Does the president think of children as accessories and not central to the purpose of family sanctity in our country? Okay, the left says it's deeply opposed to splitting up families. So were they even more horrified watching an American citizen permanently separated from her family by an illegal alien? On CNN, Senator Elizabeth Warren provided a very clear answer, no. The real problem, she said, is family separations of illegal aliens. Watch. I'm so sorry for the family here, and I know this is hard, not only for the family, but for the people in her community, the people throughout Iowa. Um, but one of the things we have to remember is we need an immigration system that is effective, that focuses on where real problems are. Where real problems are. Marion Mendoza is the mother of police sergeant Brandon Mendoza, who was killed by an illegal immigrant. She joins us tonight. Ms. Mendoza, thank you very much uh, for joining us. Thank you. Tiger. So, when you hear a politician say, yeah, someone died and that's sad, but the real problem is how we treat people trying to sneak into our country illegally, what's your response to that? I was disgusted by Senator Elizabeth Warren hearing her speak today, and what I need, what I want to say to her is, stop lying to the American people because you don't care what is happening to the victims of illegal alien crime. Because if you did, you would be standing up for us and you would be doing something about it. We have pleaded with these politicians to do something to protect American citizens, and they are ramping up their protection of illegal alien criminals. And I just want to say. You know, there, there are so many victims, Tucker, and when you think of Courtney Hacking in Texas and her husband and two children were killed and the illegal alien got two years, when you think of Sanders Cohan and Carlos Wolf in Maryland who were killed on the side of the road and Maryland charged that illegal, $140 for each of the men he killed and that's the only punishment he got. Is this what an American life is worth? to our politicians and to our, to our fellow Americans who don't understand this disgusting narrative that is happening in our country. And this has become political because it's the very politicians who are elected into office who are not doing a dang thing about this and they're ignoring the American people crying for help and they're stepping over dead American bodies in their rush to protect illegal alien criminals. I don't think you're overstating that. I agree with everything you said, and I'm really sad about it. And I'm sad that you've felt the sting of these insane policies. Uh, Mary Mendoza, thank you very much for joining us. I want to I wanna just say that my heart goes out to the Tibbetts family, and God yeah. bless them. And I know what they're experiencing tonight, and I'm heartbroken.